Hey guys, this is Dan Siefer from MobileBurn.com and right now I'm going to take a quick tour of the brand new Facebook messaging application that just came out for Android and uh, Android smartphones and the iPhone. Uh, now this is the messenger application here. It's built on the Beluga technology that Facebook purchased from the uh, group messaging company earlier this year and it features a lot of things that we saw in the Beluga app uh, when that was being actively developed um, but it's been integrated with Facebook's own messaging system and it's got some really cool features so let's take a look at that here so if we pop it open the first thing that we see here is uh, our inbox for um, our Facebook messengers uh, messages and what it will do is it will aggregate all of uh, the uh, messages from your Facebook messaging and your chats together in uh, single threads so you can um, see your threads very easily and you can um, organize them quickly and simply as well. Now if on the Android version here if we hit the menu button we can jump into settings and we can turn things on and off like uh, alerts for push notifications for if uh, we're outside of the app and we get a message come in and you can change the location services as well. Uh, the iPhone application has a similar set of features as well uh, for alerts and location settings too. Now there's some cool things that uh, you can do with this so if we go to our upper right hand corner and compose a new message we can um, select friends from our Facebook account or friends that are in our contact list. Now if the friends are in our contact list and they're not on Facebook what the app will do is actually send them a text message with whatever uh, message that you've put in. But for now let's use somebody who's on Facebook so if we search for our good friend Russ let's use uh, Russ Jeffries these are our correspondent in the UK and so then we can select him and we can easily add more contacts if we wanted to so we could start a group chat um, much like Beluga offered. Now uh, so then we can uh, do a couple different things we can compose our message here and you can turn on and off your location quickly and easily within the conversation so you can toggle that right there which is pretty cool. If you notice to the left of the compose box we've got the camera icon here which uh, will allow you to add a picture from your uh, phone that you've already taken. You can take a new photo or you can do something uh, really cool which is um, do an image search and what that will do is it will open up Bing image search integrated into the app and then you can search for an image for anything. So let's do Let's pop that in there and then we can add a little text to it. And then the message will get sent. Now if Russ is on uh, uh, Facebook on his computer, he will see this right there on his uh, computer. Or if he's got it signed into his phone, he will get the notification directly on his phone. And as you can see right there, it's inserted the uh, picture that we added as well. So that's pretty cool. Now when you're in a conversation you do got a couple of extra options. If we hit the menu key or excuse me if we hit the um, cog wheel up here you can turn on uh, or control the alerts for this conversation. Much like Beluga offered you can mute the conversation for a full hour if you are not wanting to be disturbed or you can turn uh, the um, alerts off until 8 a.m. the next morning if it's uh, going to be nighttime and you don't want to be disturbed or of course you can turn the um, alerts off entirely. If you uh, hit the people tab you can see the people that are uh, actively in the conversation and it gives you a shortcut to create a group conversation right there. Then uh, if we go to the map you can see uh, if the members of the conversation have added their location you can see them right on the map there. So it's a pretty cool uh, integration of both Facebook's messaging systems and then the group messaging technologies that Beluga had. Um, and it's a nice standalone application from Facebook so you don't have to go into the main Facebook app in order to access your messages. So it's pretty cool, pretty quick and easy to use. Imagine this is going to become pretty popular amongst uh, smartphone users and Facebook users alike. Uh, the new Facebook Messenger app is available now for the iPhone and Android platforms and it's free, available in the iTunes uh, App Store and the Android Market. But for now, this is Dan Seifert with MobileBurn.com. Thanks, guys.